Hello friends, Tony here, welcome. Uh, in this video, I'm going to work with filament. I have a long time working with uh, filament on YouTube, uh, showing you examples on filament. So I have created a project and this is a fresh project with a breeze and uh, just installed filament. Now in this video, I want, uh, for example, here I am in the filament and I want to navigate to the user dashboard. So right now we are in the admin, but here we have the default uh, breeze dashboard. Also, when I'm here, I want to have a link here to navigate the admin panel. And then when I am on the admin, I want a link here to navigate the dashboard and also on the profile. So here we have a profile with this breeze starter kit. For that, on the Let's open the VS Code and we can open the navigation blade inside the layouts. And we have a slot, a drop down link for the logout and also for the profile. Here, I'm going to copy this and just add another one. This one is going to be the route or chef without the route, just slash admin. And I'm going to say admin here. Now, if I save and come here, refresh. Ah, yeah. Sorry for that. Come here and refresh. Now, if I click, we have admin and we navigate here. Now, the same thing I want to do on the filament. And with filament, you can go to filament documentation. On the panel builder, we have customizing the user menu. On the configuration file, we need to add, we need to change user menu items, and then put here how many menu items you want. So let's do that. Let's search for the admin panel provider. And at the end, I'm going to add, I'm going to chain a new method, which is this one user menu items okay so let's say user menu items and here as you can see expect to have an array of menu items so let's do that add an array and let's say uh, menu item colon colon make to make a new and i'm going to leave it there i to fill this so the label is going to be profile uh, the icon is going to be hero icon and the URL is going to be slash profile. In this case, we need to change that. If I save and now let's come here. Uh, yeah, we need to close this. Okay. Now let's come here and refresh. We are on the admin. If I click here now, we have the profile and let's add also the dashboard. So I'm going to say menu item again. Make. And here now, not log out, but uh, I'm going to, yeah, let's leave it for now like this and change from log out to say dashboard or user. We're going to say dashboard. The hero icon is going to be hero icon uh, home. And the URL is going to be dashboard. Okay, come here. Yeah, let's close this, come here and refresh. We can navigate now to the dashboard. Okay, and from here we can navigate to admin. Now you can read more on the filament documentation as I told you. User menu items, add here the profile and menu item. Make, label, edit profile. Also scroll down. We have the visible based on the condition. So if our user can view any or hide hidden, if the our user can not view any, and also use a action, so function, string, route, log session, and so on. Okay, friends, that's it. What I wanted to show you in this video, how we can make uh, add links 
on the user drop down menu here to navigate back to dashboard and the same in here so we can visit the profile directly from there now if you like such a video so don't forget to subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and see you in the next one all the best thank you very much